The time for National Kite Day comes one of the cutest books from one of the most wonderful local people. This is an he's an absolute gem. His name is Will Hillenbrand. He's a local illustrator you, and author, Tom. artist. It's called Kite Day. It's a Baron Mole story. This is your latest book. It's actually yes, it the second in a series. It is. The first one came out last year. It was called Spring is Here. Won uh, all kinds of awards. It did. And uh, this is the follow-up. So if you um, love a good story with a surprise ending and you love flying kites, this is a book for you. Okay, what I really love, and you're telling me this off air, is that this is really a story about you and your son. It is, and I think uh, kite flying is universal, uh, and so if you, there, there's nothing like holding a kite, the, the string at the end of a kite. I mean, it's just magic, and to be able to see the kite lifting up in the air. So, of course, I did that with my son, but my dad did it with me. Yeah. And I was really uh, those no two stories. No real electronics involved in that. It's <laughs> no, just not you, at all. a kite, and your son. Well, and it, it, the adventures mean a child wants uh, to have action, and uh, seeing something fly. I mean, it's, it, it takes you right to the Wright brothers. I mean, there's a fascination of how things fly in the air. Okay, that picture that you just saw on the screen. I don't know if we can come back out. Look at this. This is this particular picture. Okay, I, I, I'm so fascinated by such incredibly talented people like yourself. How do you do this? How does it go from your brain through your fingertips and become this? It's simple. You have to draw it out. <laughs> well, I know, but you have to be talented to do that. Can I, and I don't even know, I don't think we'll be able to see the little pencil drawing. I'm going to hold up these other two. Tell me what goes through your mind when you, when you, you know you're, do you have to be in a happy place to, to draw this? Well, I think it's the same place a child goes when they play. And when you're playing, um, you, you're basically, you're transfixed. You end up going to the place that, uh, uh, Look at this. What, you, what I'm taking to you what I see in my head. I'm describing to you what, what I actually do see in my head. And um, whether we believe that or not, if you have dreams at night, it's kind of the same thing. Um, to be a success in this incredibly difficult business takes so much and such incredible talent and tenacity. Or, do you look at yourself sometimes and pinch yourself? Because you, a kid growing up in College Hill did pretty good. Well, I, I am very fortunate to be able to do work for people I adore. They just happen to be, of course, very young children. And of course, it's, it's empowering to allow them to be able to um, be able to read because um, our, our language that we hear is the one we speak, but in print it's a foreign language. Yeah. Having really strong pictures, having compelling stories, draws them into the world of print. And, it, and of course, then eventually empowers them to be able to, to know and, want and be more. You have a way for kids to make their own kite. I do. Uh, and you can do that on my website. It's a YouTube video. You can go to that on my, my book activities page. And children can make their very own yeah, it up. kite and it actually does fly it, it does you need a pretty good wind but it works <laughs> <laughs> maybe the hair dryer isn't going to be enough but you can go do this and you can make this yourself will hildebrand is there any opportunities for people to come meet you have you read the book to them soon well um just keep an eye on my uh, facebook page and whenever there's a posting for a signing you can you can find it there it's just will hildebrand books on Facebook and you'll find it there. It's called Kite Day, a bear and mole story. I'm so excited that you have two more coming and because that means you get to come back at least yeah. twice more. Great. And I love that. I love having you around. Thanks, Super. Will.